welcome back to the random channel and today we are playing some more just cause 3 motorcycle vlogs now we're going to call it something a little different i'm still thinking of something just uh give me some suggestions down in the comments section yeah leave some suggestions down in the comment section hey go ahead and do that while i'm moving this truck also while you're down there Hit that subscribe button and that like button and make sure to turn on that notification bell so that you don't miss out on a single one of my videos. Uh, so this is our apartment and I'm not going to take the stairs up because we don't have an elevator. Not in Medici. We're in dirt poor country. Uh, that's my helicopter. Uh, yeah. I'm going to use that to go out there. Yeah, you see, right out there. Oh, uh, it's not, it's not fully rendering in. Ah, that's all right. Uh, we're not gonna be going out there today. Why does it look so weird? It's not even fully rendering in. So, uh, yeah, we don't have an elevator. Uh, so we're just gonna have to stick with like stairs and grappling hooks and, and stuff like that. So, uh, anyway, here is my Geshwin. It's, I, I like it. It was, <sighs> all right, let's do this. So, I do like, oh, sorry guys, I do like the, uh, red, get red and white Geshwin. Uh, sorry guys, I, uh, I stayed up a little too late last night. Yeah, see, you can even, like, unlock helicopters in this area. It's, like, big enough for it. You just gotta take down a couple of trees. Take down a couple of trees and it'd be good for a helicopter landing. I mean, I don't want to crash into a bunch of trees. I swear if this breaks my bike... Yes, they went down. Okay. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. I was just taking down some trees. But was it enough? Where's all this shade coming from? Like, really? Like, oh, that one. Anyway, so we got it cleared. So now we have a good place to land helicopters. Of course. I don't really need a helicopter because, I mean, I've already got one. Let's just make that easily accessible from the auto body shop. So, I am so going to get arrested for that. Yeah, I know that, ma'am, who used to be my dispatcher when I was with the police force. Oh my gosh, I'm never going to get over that. Okay. I do regret quitting the police force. I do. And, uh, so yeah, I regret it. And, uh, we're going to see, we're going to try one week of, uh, we're going to try a week or two of the, uh, old platform, but, uh, if we don't like it, we'll just, you know, switch to the, uh, the police force again, which, I mean, I'm not going to be one of those people that, like, can't keep a job, but it's just, it's all about s choosing the right job for you, and I think the police force may have been a good job. It may have been something that I really wanted to do. Uh, I'm pretty sure they're going to get my helicopter off the roof if I leave the city while I'm not watching, but you know what, I don't care. So let me tell you what happened, uh, uh, while I was off camera. So, since I am actually part of the Rebel Alliance, uh, don't think I'm talking about Star Wars. Anyway, so, uh, I get into combat, I can get into combat situations with the DRM. Me and a couple of other Rebel trucks were chasing a DRM truck that had a rebel in the back seat. Uh, host, uh, he was captured, he was going to prison. 
we weren't going to let that happen. So we were chasing him, we were shooting him, all that good stuff. Anyway, so uh, we get so close to getting him, and all of a sudden something bad happens. A Vistosa comes through the intersection, T-bones him, and of course how low to the ground the front end of that Vistosa is, flipped him over. Just flipped him over. And uh, the, bad, the bad thing is though, when it flipped, it stayed on its roof. It didn't correct itself. And that's, that sucks because, I mean, you have to think, there's a rebel guy in the back seat. When that thing flipped, it flipped violently. It rolled a couple of times and then it just stuck on its back end, on its top. And I'm like, oh no. The guy, and the DRM guys got out before it started flipping, which is actually surprising to me. I'm pretty sure that was a glitch. Uh, and like, we kill them, and the rebels drive off, and I'm like, okay, I'll deal with the rebel in, in the back seat. So I'm trying to figure out how to get this back door off. I am ramming big vehicles into that car ever so lightly so that I don't blow it up. And all of a sudden, I have a good idea. Beat the door till it comes off with my elbow. And it worked. It worked. I beat the door till it came off. And I dragged the rebel to safety. Did a little bit of a role play 911 calling. And that's pretty much all that happened. Uh, I left the scene. The body despawned, which is kind of like an ambulance coming to pick her up. And that was it. So, I was going to make a... I'm so glad I didn't blow through that intersection. I'd be dead meat. You're dead meat. Real dead meat. driving just for the fun of driving. Okay, we're going to try and drive this dirt bike through these off-roads. Trying not to damage it at all. Here's the problem with the off-road vehicles. They break if you go too fast. They will, like, the, fen the fenders will get beat up. Everything on the uh, vehicle will get beaten. Where's the interstate? Wait, what? Where's the interstate? You're kidding. You're kidding. You're telling me I gotta go all the way up there? Okay, I'll trust you. You know what? I'll just take the road. I don't know what we are doing in this episode of Motorcycle Vlogs. We may call it Moto Madness, but the only problem is there's a YouTube channel called Moto Madness. Uh, go check them out, by the way. They're, they're cool. Uh, but anyway, guys, so uh, we can't call it that because I don't really uh, want to do that. What would this game be like in VR? Comment down below on what you think it'd be like. Because, like, if they made it a VR version, I have a VR headset. So, I mean, all I, had to, all I have to do is just buy it. Oh, yeah! Speaking of VR, guys, we will be making a VR video today. Oh, God! Just remember, this will tear up my bike. 
I don't know why it will, the front fender there, it gets beat up. Pretty bad. Kind of like me was completely head on collision with somebody. That's what it's like. So we're not going to take our chances with that. I mean, we are taking our chances with like high speed collisions, but if I know what I'm doing, I probably won't crash. As long as this AI don't be stupid. Because if this motorcycle gets, gets hit, I am going to blow up somebody's car. And I know it ain't gonna be my motorcycle. I know it's gonna be the person who wrecked my motorcycle. But, uh, anyway. So, uh, hey guys, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and comment down below on, uh, well, there's a lot of things to comment on in this video. Did you like the video? Suggestions? Uh, anything like that, even suggestions on what we could call it, because motorcycle vlogs isn't really doing that great. Isn't isn't sticking in my mind like I thought it would. Sounds better in the head. Yeah, that's the way it is. Oh boy, I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it! I'm in, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in! I'm in this! I am in on this! Yes! Oh, that was easy. <laughs> Alright guys, so anyway, that will be all for today's video. Thanks you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in that VR video.